Yo, these prices for cloud storage are wild. There's gotta be a better way. H hold on, this might take a second. Yo, what's up? Yo, Sheed, so my cloud storage is filling up, but I'm not trying to pay these prices to increase. Is there any other option? Well, you could get a NAS. What's a NAS? So NAS stands for Network Attached Storage, and it's basically a mini computer with a bunch of slots for hard drives that always stays connected to the internet so you can manage and access your files from anywhere. So it would be like having my own personal Google Drive? Exactly. I bought this NAS from Synology and loaded it up with four 12 terabyte Western Digital Red Pro drives that were gifted to me, and that gives me a total of over 30 terabytes of storage. That's mad space. But wait, isn't 12 times 4 equals 48? Shouldn't there be more storage? The way that I actually set up this NAS, some of the storage is used to protect against drive failures. So if one of the drives fails, I can just pop in a new one and not lose any of my data. Mm, yeah, I think it's definitely time for me to try this out. How much would it cost to set up a NAS? So that'll depend on how much storage or drives that you need, but this NAS alone costs about $600, and the drives, even though they were gifted to me, cost over $1,000 altogether. But when you compare that to a 30 terabyte cloud storage plan that costs $150 a month, after a year, you would already have paid the same amount of money as it would cost to build the NAS that I have. And each of the drives in the NAS should last you around three to five years at least. 